quality of work has been improving, especially this year. Last year, I remember uh, the average score for secondary was about 30 points. This year, went up to about 62 points on the average. So you can see the improvement in the quality of work the kids are doing. I come from Ross Pants Elementary and the project I did here was the Naked Bouncy Egg. I got a raw egg and I put it in a, a clear glass cup and I put vinegar inside it. The vinegar dissolved the shell so after that I got to test it on how high it can bounce. It got to like 9 inches and it popped which is really cool because it got messy. Hello my name is Marcus Jackson and I'm from Walter Middle School, 7th grade. My project is about the solar oven. The materials we used are the pizza box, foil, plastic wrap, clear tape, black construction paper, ruler, and scissors. How we did it was we got a pizza box. We cut the top of it here, and when we put foil on this so the sunlight reflects on this. Then we put foil under the black construction tape here so that the black tarp would absorb the heat while the foil adds extra heat. And then the plastic wrap builds on when the heat goes through here, the heat builds up pressure in there, which cooked our cookies. Our hypothesis was the cookies would be undercooked, but this cookie right here is yeah, it's cooked. Our results were that um, the solar the solar rig did cook the cookies. The sun was bright enough to cook the cookies. There were like six of them, but as you can see, there's only one left. This year's science fair, I would say, it's uh, it's a lot better than last year in terms of quality, in terms of organization. There were more involvement from the teachers uh, in terms of support and also from the district. It actually, it's cross curricular. You know, we're always looking for the top quality uh, work from the students. STEM has to be promoted. Even on the national scale, the White House, the White House promotes this on a daily basis because the jobs are there, but we just don't have enough qualified people to fill the jobs. So that's why science, engineering, technology have to be in the forefront. And the superintendent just came out of a meeting talking about the same thing. Over five million on field engineering jobs in Ely County alone that companies are looking for people to fill these positions. So we have to put a lot more emphasis and, and efforts in science and technology. Mm -hmm.